volt works fod is broken the build is permissive out of the box those of you who want an enforcing build please feel free to write the se policy and send it over to the developer safety net passes if and only if you root your device and once you have rooted your device then you need to enable magisk hide from the settings and also enable magisk hide for google play services google play store and safety net is going to pass Play Store will be certified, which means you should be able to use your banking apps. Always on display works like a boss. Double tap to wake is broken. Do not enable now playing and also make sure that the permissions of microphone for your Google app are disabled. Why? Because if you enable them, you will have video lag issues in YouTube. That I think was an awesome gist of the story for Android 12 Beta 3 running like a boss on the Redmi K20 Pro. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And what do we have here? Here you have kernel version as immensity, Android version S12, security patch from July, play system from August 1, 2021. Press and hold on the empty space on your home screen, go into wallpapers and style. Yes, material you in the building. Right now you have a bluish or peelish accent color whatever you want to call it let us change it to say this one the pinkish one bam here it is accent color changed everything changed working like a boss material you in the building icons right now on your home screen are old school going to wallpapers and style one more time enable themed icons and bam there it is they have now changed on your home screen of course in your application drawer they are still the same why because this is android 12 beta 3 and expect issues in beta builds and of course your lock screen weather is working absolutely fine do note that all the resources and all the zip files whatever modules we are using are linked in the description of this video and of course we do have the android 12 extras module installed because the build does not come with google feed out of the box so i have installed that module and as you can see the google feed is smooth pretty smooth pretty fast animations dope pretty dope here it is pixel launcher select working without any issues screenshot bam works like a boss rounded corners edit and share icons and let us also open the settings try to take another screenshot and now we get the option of capture more select this and boo yeah here it is android 12 beta 3 features looking pretty dope pretty smooth on the redmi k20 pro as well next up if i open my recents and i have a page with the link so i do have chrome tap on this link i can now copy the link directly from my recents app opening animations oh my god these are so smooth trust me i am in love with android 12 and android 12 animations so much so that sometimes i don't feel like making videos on android 11 anymore and of course as you can see the weather is working on the home screen and on the lock screen as well do note as i mentioned earlier you will have to install the android 12 extras magisk module for that to work next up let us head over into settings again new ui new style everything is smooth and pretty smooth let us go into system go into front camera settings yes the front camera works absolutely fine pro tip over here make sure you have disabled the camera led and then you can use your favorite gcam port working without any issues go into gestures here are the different options which you have double tap on the back is broken then you have system navigation two different options go into settings you can disable the assistant swipe in case you want to do that and you also have 100 mode so swipe down 100 mode working like a boss or you can use it to show your notifications here it is it should now show me my notifications yep working without any issues and you can also enable a shortcut for your 100 mode so if i enable this toggle got it here it is this is the floating bar which i have enabled or you can also enable the volume keys combination in case you want to do that 
Now another pro tip over here is that if you want to use your Google Assistant then you might have issues with YouTube media playback. Google Assistant works with the screen turned on and with the screen turned off. The only issue is that once you do that you will have YouTube media lag issues. So what is the fix? Go into your Google app info going to permissions and then deny this the microphone permission and you should be good to go next up if you head over to the sound and vibration options and then you can go into media you do have your pinning the media player toggle and the show media recommendations toggle is also present on this build next up we can go into the display options and see the different customizations which you get over there so automatic brightness works go into lock screen here and you do have now playing please do not enable this you will have major sound issues and lag issues and always on display is there works absolutely fine tap to phone does not work wake screen for new notifications works without any issues as does dark theme works like a boss similarly you also have night light and as you can see this feature also works without any issues you have the option of changing your colors but i don't think so this option is working right now increased touch sensitivity is there double tap to wake is broken dc dimming is also present but in my testing it did not work display colors option is there but again you cannot enable or disable the toggle then if you head over to your storage options you do have the option of trash now and if you swipe down on your quick settings panel tap on internet you can now turn off the wi-fi from your home screen itself previously in beta 2 you had to go inside the internet settings and turn it off in terms of your widgets well you do have the new conversation widget but unfortunately there are no weather or the cool looking clock widget because google has not rolled them out either and another thing before i forget is that monet or theming your gboard based on the accent colors is not working either but again that has not been rolled out by google fully next up what about the gaming mode so how do you enable gaming mode go into settings and in settings search for game once you search for game you will have something called game settings tap on this enable your game dashboard once you do this open any game so i do have pacman installed and you will not get the option right away what you need to do next is let us go to our home screen minimize this and then let us open something else let us open this chrome page and then go back to your recents and now open the game you see this arrow tap on this guy you see this controller tap on it bam here it is gaming dashboard in the building you do have your do not disturb is on for game then you have your fps meter screen record and the option to take a screenshot all of these are present inside this pill which can of course be moved around in case you want to and we just took a screenshot so that feature works fps meter works tap on the screen record option and it should open up the screen recorder only if i can get rid of this screenshot notification so again android 12 beta 3 bugs are clearly visible nothing to blame the developer for let us give it one more try recorder bam here it is recorder in the building of course you can record device audio and microphone at the same time and that is something which was added with android 11 again as you can see we're not getting the option so go to the recents switch over to wikipedia go back to the game and here it is tap on the controller you do have youtube live as well and this feature works right now game optimization is either not available for this game or my humble opinion is that google has not enabled it in the back end or in the beta itself next up in terms of youtube media playback again as i told you once you disable the microphone permission for the google app media playback is absolutely fine no jitters no lags picture in picture works double tap gesture on picture in picture works without any issues of course for picture in picture to work either you need to have youtube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for YouTube premium. Then do you have any issues with applications downloading from the Play Store once you root your device and enable Magisk Hide? We can check that. Let us go ahead and download the Google Photos application from the Play Store and see if we are facing any download issues. I don't think so. Here it is 49%, 93, 96, 99 installing like a boss. And once that is done, we can of course open the application and see what we are getting. 
so there it is you can see we are getting original quality which will count towards our storage or storage saver which will not count towards our storage we can skip this and next up let us try to edit a picture of my favorite football star to see if we are getting the option for portrait light or not so wait for this loading bar to finish once that is done going to adjust portrait light bam here it is portrait light working without any issues of course super important thing you need to remember is that portrait light only works on human objects if i try to edit this picture of my chicken friend over here i will not get the option of portrait light pretty dope ai by google million dollar question is this a daily driver for me yes why because i like to run the latest android build on my devices and i am more than happy super grateful for the developers who put in all the hard work behind this to get us the latest android build of course you do have some drawbacks like fod not working but good news here is that i think k dragon or somebody else found that beta 3 has some fod implementation not fully implemented so hopefully you do get a proper working build with the next beta again all depends on google nothing the developers can do about that other than that haven't seen any excessive battery drain features are pretty dope another great build for the redmi k20 pro and trust me i feel so good when it's like poco f1 redmi k20 pro poco f3 all of them are running android 12 at the same time bliss what else can i ask in life for and there it is peeps that was our first look at android 12 beta 3 running on the redmi k20 pro and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you